channel today i will be talking about mary Kay foundation so let's just go ahead and hop right in my brow products are not from mary Kay, so i skipped right over that i always start my makeup with my mary Kay under eye corrector i then use my elf total face sponge to blend it all out or in I then use my Mary Kay translucent powder to set my under eye corrector and the concealer that is on my eyelids. Right after setting that, I go in with my Mary Kay foundation primer and mine has the broad spectrum SPF 15 in it. All you need is that little dot. Spread it, this little dots all over my face and then blend it all in. As you can see, I do avoid my under eye area because of my fine lines under my eyes. I like to leave that set. I don't want anything that's going to make it oily at all. so I did a voiceover so I finally go in with my chroma fusion cinnabar eyeshadow I apply that in my crease and just above my crease I really wish I remember what I was saying right there as you can see I take my time to slowly build it up I don't like to go in with a lot of product right in the beginning because it can make it too dark and so I just take my time and gradually build that up okay so right here I'm spraying my brush with my Mary Kay setting spray before going in with my chroma fusion shiny penny eyeshadow With this eyeshadow, I'm putting it right over my lid or on my lid. And as you can see, once again, I continue to apply until I am satisfied. Wow. I really wish what I was telling you guys. Or I really wish I knew what I was telling you guys. 
All right, finally, it is time for the start of the show. I'm now going to go in with my Mary Kay Time Wise Matte Wear Liquid Foundation. I'm in the color bronze one. I just apply a little to my hand and slowly build up the coverage with my total face sponge. Once again, I do avoid directly under my eye. I do get closer to my eye with the foundation because I do want it to blend in the end. But I still do not get into those creases that I created or that life has created for me. Okay, so now I'm going to start concealing under my eye. Um, my concealers are not from Mary Kay. Um, however, I am using um, a concealer from Revolution as well as Tarte Shape Tape. I also go ahead and blend that in with my e.l.f. Total Face Sponge as well. And then, of course, I'll go behind that with the Mary Kay translucent powder. I know that it seems like a lot for the under eye, but I apply my makeup a little differently to um, go with what I need for my day to day. And that's that routine helps me um, keep from creasing under the eye longer. Next, I move on to go ahead and set my foundation with my mineral powder, and I just blend it all over. I also get right there where that translucent, translucent powder was, and blends and blend that in very well as well. Here I start to prepare to bronze my face. I'm going in um, with my Mary Kay Chroma Fusion Contour in the color Latte. But first I do a little uh, cheat here and I use my contour stick from Fenty in the color Truffle. Um, I do this since I want to prolong my makeup for that day. As you can see I go in and blend it in with my sponge. Then after blending in with my sponge, I go in with my powder contour, um, and I do that with the brush. Alright, so now I'm going to go in with my blush. 
Um, the blush I'm using today is my um, Chroma Fusion Blush in Darling Pink. I think I forgot what I was doing in for a second. Now you see me digging in my Mary Kay container. And what I was digging for is my Chroma Fusion Highlighter in the color Glazed. And I pretty much apply this highlighter everywhere. I start above my cheekbones. bridge of my nose my cupid's bow and finally I go in to highlight my brow bone Right then, I drown myself in my setting spray, and that is the um, it's just a Mary Kay setting spray. While I was letting it dry, I noticed like, oh my gosh, I don't have any mascara on. So I went back and fixed that. I'm so sorry. I use a thousand different mirrors when doing my makeup. So, excuse me. Alright, and here is a quick close look just before I finish um, my look off the look off of the camera. Okay, so this is my final look. Um, with my hair and my earrings and I'm dressed now. Um, here's a close-up of the Mary Kay foundation. Once again, this is the matte liquid foundation, matte wear liquid foundation from the Time Wise line. Um, like, uh, some other big uses were the um, translucent powder, the Chroma Fusion highlighter, the um, Darling Pink blush. I use the shiny penny eyeshadow and then I use the um what's the other one the cinnabar in my crease and I also use the glazed highlighter um oh yeah and I added the coral bliss lipstick here at the end it's also by Mary Kay it's very moisturizing as you can see this does not have a lip gloss on top of it so if you are interested in the Mary Kay foundation and this long natural looking wear, please contact me to order today. Thank you guys for watching.